and with people from around 180 countries congregating right here at the United Nations headquarters for the ninth International Day of Yoga. That is just a sample of the way in which the occasion has been marked, not just here in the United States or in India, but around the world. Our next report taking a closer look at how the world is celebrating the International Day of Yoga. A field full of Indians practicing yoga. Crouching with their hands stretched forward. A classic yoga position. The citizens have appreciated Prime Minister Modi's contribution in marking Yoga Day. Any amount of appreciation for Prime Minister Modi is still not enough. He has been instrumental in marking today as International Yoga Day across the world. He has made such a huge contribution in making people practice and be aware of yoga, not only in the country but across the world. To take it to the masses and create its identity, this has been done by our Prime Minister Narendra Modi and today not only in the country but all over the world, people now believe in yoga without any bias of class and caste. Now let's go a little to the south in the southern state of Tamil Nadu. You may have seen this type of yoga before. It's called water yoga. The people are calm and composed with no signs of hesitation. How does water yoga help a person? It soothes the nervous system, relieves stress, helps heal insomnia and detoxifies the body. In UAE, people are doing yoga in a vibrant indoor space. What makes this unique is that the event is inside an art museum. Citizens are celebrating inside the Louvre Abu Dhabi. In Malaysia, instructors are helping people hold their yoga positions. I did a lot of postures. When I followed the, what the instructor was saying, I could feel that you feel a lot of stress-free, anxiety-free phase. You get into that. So definitely with yoga, you can bring peace. You can bring happiness and prosperity as well. Children are also practicing breathing patterns. Little kids all over the world are now getting the hang of yoga. The children are striking poses ranging from the Virubhadra Sena to the Bhujangasana. The Indian army was seen stretching their limbs to the sky in Sikkim. The men wore their layered outfits in the bone-chilling temperatures, then synchronized their movements as the national flag waved behind them. The Indian Army celebrated Yoga Day in 106 places along the Indian border. This celebration stretched from Ladakh and Siachen to the tip of Kanyakumari. The Indian Navy, which is known as the ambassador for yoga across the seas, is also spreading the message through the Ocean Ring of Yoga. Now what is the Ocean Ring of Yoga? It's an initiative where Navy ships visit friendly foreign nations and spread the message of Vasudeva Kutumbakam, which translates roughly to the world is one family. This is also the theme of this year's International Yoga Day. This year, the Indian Navy will visit countries like Russia, United States, Egypt, Indonesia, Kenya, Morocco, Sri Lanka, Thailand and Oman. India's Defence Minister Rajnath Singh was present on INS Vikrant, an Indian aircraft carrier practicing yoga with Navy personnel. This year, Yoga Day was marked in India's research stations in the Arctic and the Antarctic regions as well. Pure report, Vion, World is One.